Morning guys, welcome back to the off-grid cabin build series. Two days now, and it looks like sunny weather. Ah, uh, but coming up in the forecast is several days of rain. So if we're gonna get this floor painted, it's gonna have to be today. We're kind of in a rush too, because we got an appointment at one o'clock today. But if you take a look at it, it's looking pretty good, pretty dry. There's a couple damp spots still where stuff was setting on it, but hopefully, in a couple hours, by the time we get to painting it, it'll be good to go. So we got a sanding block, some 60 grit paper, and some seams that are a little tiny bit high. We're gonna try to sand those down. That sandpaper works really good. We're not going for perfection here, just trying to knock down the high spots. It's already all rough, you know, because it's OSB. Yeah, it's good. Can't even really feel it anymore. So I'm gonna go around the floor, find any more high spots kind of like that, sand them down so we can get painting. Got a new saw blade. So we'll go ahead and cut these guys out all the way. And if you remember yesterday's video, that saw blade was pretty sorry. All right. Pink. Beautiful. Yeah. Now the question is, how do we do these ones? How do we do these ones? It's gotta be with the Sawzall. Beautiful. All right, that's how you do it, I guess. We'll just keep going, get the other ones done, and things will be going good. All right, it's time to start painting now, guys. Already got a little start here around the edges. We're using pyramid paint. This is a bucket that actually fell out the windowsill. Jules is down, cleaning it off the wall now. But uh, yeah, we'll go around the edges. Then we'll hit it with a roller. Hopefully it'll turn out all right. It's actually a different color than I thought it would be. It's kind of a pink color. Let's put you guys down here. You can, uh, let's see, where do you guys want to be? Hmm? Let's put you over here. You can see the action as it progresses. So Joe's is gonna go around, do the edges, and then I'm doing, I'm doing the big stuff here. It took quite a bit more paint than we thought it would, and it doesn't look as pink anymore as it used to, but we went, got some more paint, and uh, we're gonna continue on here, guys. Go ahead and put you guys over here so you can get a bird's eye view of what's going on, okay?
we have had quite a bit of rain since we painted the floor and it seems to be holding up really good. The water just kind of beads up on it. We can sweep the water off, no problems. We painted in the cracks really well. I like we tried to kind of seal them down, down in there with the paint. So hopefully it's not just getting trapped in those seams, but it seems to be holding up really good and the color's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be, right? It still seems kind of pink to me, but it's supposed to be pyramid, the color anyway, right? Pyramid, I'm thinking pyramid in an autumn Egyptian sunset, a little pink or something. But this is what it is right here, guys. It is the Bear Premium Porch and Patio Floor Paint. Designed for floors. Guys, you wanna see what else we're doing here on our homestead, there is a video right over here that you might like to go ahead and check out. Otherwise, guys, hope you have a really great day. Keep smiling, and I'll see you right over there in just a second. <music>